How's it going my fellow captains and welcome. Now guys, I made a video a while back talking about the situation that's occurring over at China with the Hainan group. And unfortunately, even more bad news is on the way because currently the group is in debt of nearly $100 billion to various banks, investors and even its own subsidiaries. Now I'm not joking here, they actually owe $100 billion and it really makes you think how the hell did they find themselves in this rather nasty situation. Now it goes without saying that they are very desperate with their debt only increasing. The group has tried to lower their debt by borrowing more money from its own companies including Heinen Airlines and Swiss Port to pay back their debt that they can no longer repay. Now the entire company is so desperate for cash and according to reports given by people inside the group, it's often described that they've been reckless meaning that they've even tried to persuade their own employees to reinvest their salaries back into their company. Now, Supana Airlines, which is owned by Heinen, was being sued by Atlas Air for unpaid debts, and it's only now has the case been settled for a payment of almost $10 million. But in order to understand the situation, we need to ask ourselves what exactly has happened for the airline group to be in a such a hopeless situation. Well guys, the simple answer is, is that they've borrowed way too much money. Now the Heinen group funded much of its own growth with debt, meaning they borrowed as much money as they possibly can for their expansion and hopefully make a hefty profit so they can repay it all back. Now this practice is not uncommon in Asia, where many companies often build on scale to increase their political and commercial advantage. However, Heinen seems to have reached its limits of this strategy and there are free lenders who have frozen credit lines due to mispayments, while the group has been paying interest rates as high as 12% to secure short-term funding. Now, in order to rectify the situation, they're selling majority of their assets to help with their liquidity problems. They've sold an office building in Sydney for $166 million, but they failed to sell their airline Swissport and they currently owe them $300 million. So I mean overall, the group has control of an enormous airline and it seems like the only thing keeping them going is willpower. They fail to sell any of their assets that they aim for and nobody is willing to pay the asking price for the sale and the demands for cash on the airline are weakening its own ability to stay in business. Could we see the end of Hainan Airlines and also the group? Well, I can't really answer that one but one thing is for sure is that their future looks very bleak at this moment in time. So captains, that's all there is for Heinen at the moment. It seems like they found themselves in a very bad situation from their own making and we can only hope that they rectify the problems and hopefully keep the airlines afloat. Now guys, if you have any further opinions or thoughts then by all means share it with us, like and subscribe and stay tuned for the next video.